Hey guys, what's up? It's Prowler High Def, and today I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to install brushes in Pixelmator. And basically, Pixelmator, as a, it, you guys know what it is, it's a photo editing program. It's a kind of like Photoshop and GIMP, only it's designed for Mac OS X Line and it's free. I think it's a great program, I've been using it lately. And uh, today I'm just going to be showing you guys how to install brushes 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 if i can speak so i'm just gonna open up safari and i'm gonna go on to brush easy dot com i'll have a link in the description to this channel because they make great brushes for photoshop and pixelmator now uh... i think what i've figured out or have learned is that Photoshop brushes can also be used in Pixelmator, so I'm just gonna take these explosion brushes, which look amazing, and download the file. Now, uh, it's downloading, just give it a minute. Minimize that. Oh, why did I minimize that? Uh, I know I said that I might be making an After Effects tutorial today, but the truth is that I didn't know what I was gonna make it about. Also, I, uh, I was gonna make it on like Modern Warfare 2 or something, but I didn't have any clips, and I don't even have an HTPVR. So if anybody has any uh, MW2 clips recorded with an HTPVR, please send them to me. I'd love to edit them for you, and uh, make my first little mini edit. Um, okay, just downloaded. I have a whole load of files right here. Oh god, it was called Explosion Brushes. Jeez. I have such a hard time finding stuff in here. Explosion brushes. That zip and I'll unzip. Uh, unable to expand to APR into downloads. What? Why do they hate me? Come on. Oh, here we go. Okay, so now open up Pixelmator and make sure you have your brushes tab right there. Go in and drag this on top of the brushes, and see it just installed a whole new thing of uh, brushes that are explosions Rawr. and it looks like this is designed to go in like the corner or something just giant explosions wow these are pretty nice I don't know what it's all about why they have to be gigantic and stuff whoa but these are pretty cool I think I think I don't know what you guys think tell me what you think description oh look and it even installed a whole new category that's amazing I'm so happy so uh yeah how how long was this tutorial like 20 seconds probably um on just how, how to get brushes in in the pixelmator in case nobody knows that there's also another way just i find i find that way simpler it's like go into the pixelmator file under brushes and just uh put the brush into there the dot abr file but uh yeah so that does mean that uh pixelmator stuff i mean oh god photoshop stuff can be used in pixelmator and uh in case you're wondering what i'm doing i'm just looking around here cuz i don't know a lot about this website and they make some cool stuff on here so yeah definitely go check these guys out and uh I guess you can sign up for an account. I didn't know. I didn't know that. See that? Learn something new every day. Like, watching this tutorial. I, I don't know what I'm rambling on about. M I might have a another tutorial coming out in a, uh, either a couple of minutes after this one, an hour, I have no idea. Tomorrow, um, just keep, stay subscribed to my channel or whatever because, uh, I'm definitely going to have a uh, After Effects tutorial coming out in a few days when I get some clips. So like I said, please uh, send me some clips if you have some, but please try and send them in a uh, Mac compatible, f uh, what what's it called? Uh, God, I can't think. Uh, just make them Mac compatible, like a dot .mov format, that's what it's called, format. Uh, make it like dot .mov or dot .mp4 or something, something, uh, I'm able to open up on here, like, not dot, uh, God, WMV, because I have this converter, and it just doesn't work that good, because I don't want to get into it, whatever. Okay, well, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll, uh, see you in the next tutorial.